The car rental business has been decimated by a pandemic that has had a devastating impact on the company's finances, its share price and its staff, with the Hertz boss forced to resign after the company's missed lease payments and laid off more than 10,000 staff last month. Car rental giant Hertz has filed for bankruptcy after failing to reach an agreement with the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention CDC. The Wall Street Journal first reported the bankruptcy filing, which was filed by the company's chief executive and chief financial officer. The heavily indebted car rental company, one of America's largest, has announced it will file for bankruptcy protection to withstand the effects of a coronavirus pandemic that has crippled global travel and its impact on the car rental industry. According to the New York Times, Hertz filed for Chapter 11 protection on Tuesday, becoming the latest victim of travel restrictions that have decimated car rentals after last year's deadly influenza outbreak in Europe. Hertz and its subsidiaries will continue operations, the company said. However, the Estero, Florida-based company's lenders were unable to grant the company an extension of its $1.2 billion loan guarantee, triggering the filing of a $2.5 billion debt ratio. The filing does not include the impact of the coronavirus pandemic on the U.S. auto industry, the statement said. The car rental business has been decimated by the pandemic that has wreaked havoc on the U.S. automotive industry and the wider economy, with the CEO of Hertz forced to resign after the company missed lease payments and laid off 10,000 staff last month. Car rental giant Hertz has filed for bankruptcy after failing to reach an agreement with the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services over travel restrictions. The Wall Street Journal first reported that Hertz had filed for Chapter 11 protection to offset the travel restrictions that have decimated the car rental industry. The highly indebted car rental company Hertz ZTZ, the second largest in the world, has announced that it will file for bankruptcy protection to withstand the effects of the coronavirus pandemic, which has crippled global travel due to its impact on the global economy. Hertz and its subsidiaries will continue operations, the company said. The company's lenders, based in Estero, Florida, were unable to provide the company with a $1.2 billion loan, triggering the filing for Chapter 11 bankruptcy protection under U.S. bankruptcy law, the statement said, which does not include Hertz's other assets, such as its assets in the United States, Canada, Australia and New Zealand. The car rental business has been decimated in recent years as has the pandemic, with the CEO of Hertz forced to resign after the company missed lease payments and laid off 10,000 staff last month. The Wall Street Journal reported Friday that car rental company Hertz could file for bankruptcy if it cannot agree with the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services on travel restrictions for the coronavirus pandemic. Sources told the newspaper that Hertz is expected to seek Chapter 11 protection, which would exempt it from the travel restrictions that have decimated the car rental industry. After global travel fever, crippling coronavirus pandemics and their devastating effects on the business and its employees, as well as highly indebted employees, the world's second-largest car rental company, Hertz, has filed for bankruptcy protection in the United States. Hertz and its subsidiaries will continue operations, the company said. The company's lenders, based in Estero, Florida, are about to grant the company an additional $1.5 billion in loans against its debt, triggering the filing for Chapter 11 bankruptcy protection in the U.S. Bankruptcy Court for the Southern District of Florida. This filing does not affect the operations of Hertz or its employees, the statement said. Widespread travel restrictions related to the U.S. government's travel ban on travelers from Iran, Iraq and Syria have hit revenues, particularly in the car rental business. Car rental company Hertz is in talks with creditors to avoid bankruptcy, which could be just weeks away, Bloomberg reports. The company, based in Estero, Florida, is negotiating the possibility of a bailout, according to the Wall Street Journal. While the U.S. government has a $50 billion airline bailout plan, Hertz may not be able to access the program. American Airlines and United Airlines, two of the largest carriers in the United States, have strong balance sheets going into crisis. But the bigger problem facing the company is a little more complex, according to the Wall Street Journal. The company was given until the 22nd of May to submit a plan for its assets, collateralized debt obligations ABS, and other assets. The coronavirus pandemic has significantly reduced car rental business as travel has slowed due to the closure. The huge drop in sales caused by the pandemics has reduced by 70% the number of cars currently owned.
One way to make money in the event of a major financial crisis, such as that at Hertz, would be to sell all of its assets without taking international business into account. 